President-elect Obama has already promised to make digitizing America's health care system a top priority. With me to talk about this today is Jonathan Bush, Chairman and Chief Executive of Athena Health, which does medical billing and patient record services for physician practices. Jonathan, thank you very much for joining me. Thank you for having me, Vanessa. Uh, maybe we could start with a slightly personal question. Uh, Why not? <laughs> people familiar with your company know that you're a first cousin of the current president. Mm -hmm. um, but I understand you also vo voted for President-elect Obama yeah, as a health care executive. Yeah, at the risk of uh, schizophrenia, I'm a very proud first cousin of the uh, current uh, president uh, and big supporter. But I, I did vote for uh, President-elect Obama and still feels, still feels pretty good. First time ever uh, for me voting for a Democrat, but uh, I'm really excited about him. And how much of that has to do with health care? I think it has to do with his more about his emotional kind of inner self-awareness and his uh, intellectual flexibility. So I think we're all kind of ready for a little a little more flexibility. Uh, and so that it's more of that than anything I heard about health care uh, from him over the course of the uh, over the course of the election. Okay. Well, he has. Um, promised to do something that touches your industry a lot. He's Big promised um, already to invest billions of dollars into bringing uh, medical health records online or, yep. or electronically. Um, in terms of how feasible that is, how feasible is it? Well, it's, it's one of those things, like a lot of incredibly well-meaning and exciting legislation that, we've, uh, that we're carrying the wreckage from, uh, uh, from our past, uh, this is one of those things that could be tremendously uh, Adventus and also, uh, you know, tremendously damaging. Uh, on the on the uh, Adventus side, it would be incredibly exciting to see this focus turn to uh, turn into more and more and more healthcare information online. Um, the damaging side would be if uh, if the help from the government ended up in the form of subsidies for broken uh, approaches to this that have not worked in many years, then the broken purveyors of the broken approach uh, would be allowed to live longer and not die, and that would be bad. Uh, so software as a business model is the dominant approach for getting healthcare information online in healthcare. It isn't the dominant approach in financial services or retail banking or anywhere else, and it shouldn't be in healthcare. The internet has been here for a while now. Uh, and legacy servers and software and disks that sit in islands of automation uh, is not the way to go. What kind of savings are uh, some of the physicians who use your patient record services already seeing? Well, there's obviously financial savings and opportunity for doctors uh, associated with getting paid faster by AthenaNet, getting uh, AthenaNet's the network that Athena Health users are all on, all of the users in the country. 17,000 providers in 40 states are all on this one network. Uh, and they get their claims paid a lot faster. They get paid about 34% uh, faster than they were getting paid before they got on the network and about 11% more because this or that claim that was kind of dropping over the side it doesn't drop over the side uh, anymore. But the social benefit is uh, to be found in all of the other kinds of information that also doesn't leak such as lab results, prescriptions, uh, referrals to doctors, many of which uh, to other doctors, many of which just disappear today in the paper-based world that we live in. Jonathan, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me. I'm Vanessa Fermans with the Wall Street Journal.